Hello, it's Jay here again and welcome to another tutorial. In this lesson, we're going to continue on with the preparation for the blending of the skybox. And we're actually going to start getting some code into this function. So with that said, we'll come here and we'll say if open brackets underscore sunny state double equals and true we'll close brackets we'll open and we'll close there and we'll come into the comments and we'll just say if sunny state equals true or you could put if sunny state is active again you can wedge your comments any way you'd like and we're just going to copy this again four times so one two three and finally four there and i'm sure you've guessed we're just going to go through and change it the naming convention so underscore thunder state and we'll keep going for the misstate. state overcast and finally for the snow state I'll just bring the comments back into line and then we'll just go through and cho change those as well so here we'll say thunder and it's mist overcast and finally again snow Okay, we'll save that there. So inside each of these functions is where we're going to put the code for the blending of the skybox. So let's have a look at this again. When we come to pick weather, each state is set to false. For example, if we come to the sunny state, then we just set the sunny state to true, thunder, thunder state to true, and so on. And then this, if it detects one of those states is true, then that's what sky block box is going to blend to. So we're heading towards completion of this script now I mean obviously we've still got the skybox blending itself to actually input but um, let's downsize this script for now and as you can see I'm already on skyboxes here now what you'll need to do is obviously get your own skyboxes which will suit your own project now for the purposes of this tutorial I'm just going to use the old ones that used to come with the previous versions of Unity. Um, but you may want to use uh, any number of different ones but uh, what you will need is at least one sunny skybox, one sort of overcast, fairly similar but just darker, and then one darker still so if you want to in the meantime before the next lesson actually uh, begin to look and find the skyboxes you wish to use I would um, suggest possibly getting um, two or three of each sort the lighter the medium and the dark and uh, that way you can experiment and find which ones blend better once we have the actual script finished but um, we're going to leave it here for now for the simple reason is uh, I want to do a lesson where we are just handling the code for the blending and nothing else so Rather than uh, start it halfway through this video, I think it will just be easier to uh, end this video now. I know we haven't done a lot of code, but this is just uh, 
more sort of an update just getting a tiny bit of code left that we'll need in place and just a note on you definitely need to find your skyboxes now because we are very quickly approaching the point where we'll be able to blend so i hope you enjoyed this video i hope to see you next time and until then as always bye for now